Hey y'all, welcome back to Tina Swoop TV. What's up, Winnie Team? Um, I wanted to get up on here and record this video because I'm at work, but the belt haven't started yet, so I wanted to go ahead and get my video recorded for tomorrow. Remember what I told y'all? The grind don't stop. So, my hair wild because I had my hat on, but I took my hat off because I don't want to represent my company with the things that I'm saying, so that's why you don't see the company name. That's why you don't see my hair or nothing. You just see what I'm doing. So you can't say what company I work for and what company I don't work for. But with that being said, I want to encourage y'all to keep going this Mother's Day weekend. I want to encourage y'all to love y'all selves this Mother's Day weekend. Mothers and fathers. Because you got some fathers out there that's playing the mother role. So I want to encourage everybody just enjoy this weekend. Be safe. If you in Atlanta, it's cold. I want to encourage y'all to keep going after y'all dreams no matter what, no matter what it look like. Look at me, I'm tired, baby. I'm tired. I don't know if y'all can see it in my face, but I am a little tired, like, because the grind don't stop. I'm trying to make sure that I keep up with what God wants me to do. That's what I'm trying to make sure. And I'm not really tired because I got sleep, but you can just see, like, I look a little tired, but that's okay because the grind don't stop. Right now, is it, you know, when you when you grinding and God has gave, given you a dream and you going up your stuff, you're not even worried about what you what you look like. Like you're not trying to walk around look like looking like a bomb, a hot mess. Of course, if, when I'm off work, you know, I I try to dress it up and look nice, but at, you're not really concerned with what other people think. I should say. Your main concern is beginning your purpose and doing what God told you to do. That's your main concern. That's all you're worried about. You're not worried about who say what or who got what. Like, that's for children. Worrying about who got the latest fashion, who got that. All that stuff gonna come. If you don't stop and you don't get out of your purpose, all that stuff gonna come. All that stuff gonna come in due time. But right now, this is the time to focus. This is the time to get in your purpose and to do what God told you to do. Because the devil is watching and he busy. I don't know how much time people think they got. But we ain't got all that much time. So when God calls your name and tells you to get in your purpose, it's time for you to get in your purpose. Because you don't know if that's going to be your last time that you can get in your purpose. So get in your purpose and do what God told you to do. Get on the winning team. Don't worry about other people. It's going to be a struggle. It's always a struggle for the chosen one. And the chosen one is, is the people that choose to do what God wants them to do with their life. Anybody can be a chosen one. You have to choose to be chosen. You have to choose to be chosen because God don't force himself on nobody. He gives us all choices. So you have to choose to be chosen. But once you choose to be chosen, you gonna have, it's going to be hard. You have to pick up your cross, baby. It was it, cause Jesus had to pick up his cross, and Jesus had to struggle. He prayed and asked God to, if, if it be his will, take that cup away from him because it was, it was hard. It was a struggle for him. Same thing go for us. It's going to be hard for us, but we're going to come out on top. Jesus came out on top, baby. He came out on top. He resurrected in three days, baby, and he told the devil head up. He told the devil head up. He came out on top because now we have the Holy Spirit living inside of us. And the devil can't take that away from us. The, um, the Holy Spirit is a spirit. It's a human without a body. The Holy Spirit needs a body to work in. And I'm giving him my body, and I hope you choose to give him your body. The devil is a spirit. He needs a body to work through. Make sure it don't be your body. If you're not on the winning team, if you don't know Jesus Christ, this is how you get to know Jesus Christ. First, you have to ask him to come into your First, you have to believe that he is the son of God. I'm sorry. No man comes through the Father except through the Son. Second, you have to believe that he died on the cross for your sins, which he did. He died for you. He died for me. He died for the world. Third, you have to ask him to come into your life and to save you, and you will be saved. If you did those three things, welcome to the winning team. Congratulations. Um, download the Bible app. Start with the book of 1 John. It's talking about Jesus' life leading up to his death. Um, once you do with that, get with God and some who you should listen to, um, what church you should join. Any question that you have, get with God, and God will send you the people. And the people not going to tell you nothing that God haven't gave you confirmation of already. If they do, take it to God and see if that's something God wants you to pay attention to. And I encourage y'all to keep going and to not give up no matter how hard it gets. I have to make these videos for y'all, and I also have to make them for myself. I go back and listen to myself. You know, because sometimes it get hard. This this stuff ain't easy, baby. It's not easy. But only the strong survive. You got to push through it. You got to believe that you deserve the things that you're going after. You have to believe that you deserve it. All right? This has been Tina Smith TV. I love you guys. Happy Mother's Day. Have a good weekend. If you're in Atlanta, it's kind of cold. So bundle up. Have a great day.